week, a group of dedicated teachers making sure their students across Kansas City do not miss the opportunity of a lifetime. Instead of going to California for a STEM convention, they've kind of brought their own version of that same convention right here to home. It's really amazing for yeah. these kids, right? KSHB 41 News reporter Charlie Kagan shows us how it works. The whole idea is to recreate that convention feel, complete with lanyards and renting out a hotel ballroom. And the students aren't the only things buzzing inside the ballroom. Middle and high school students built these electric remote controlled cars. This one isn't that hard to control. They're racing them in Kansas City, but their fastest times go up against those of other students at the National Society of Black Engineers convention in California. Well, I like these specifically because you can uh, tinker with them and then make them as, as you want. The pandemic prevented University Academy students from going to that convention in California. Their teacher was beyond thrilled when he found out a local nonprofit called Esteem Village was recreating the convention right here in Kansas City. Learning is not something that we just do in the classroom. We gotta be able to learn outside of the classroom. That's usually where kids find out what they're gonna do with their lives. I just wanted to learn more and get some new experiences. Sumner Academy freshman Caden Hall de Jesus echoes that thought. This, this is what you get and then all the parts are separate. His favorite part of racing is when something goes wrong because it gives him a new problem to solve just like his teachers solving the problem of getting to the conference. Because then that gives you a new challenge to like work on and also also makes you think, how about how do I find a way to keep this from happening the next time? Next year, Kansas City will host the National Society of Black Engineers nationwide conference. So this is actually preparing them for 2023. Charlie Keegan, KSHB 41 News.